The March edition of Anambra Work for Life attracted sports lovers across government and social circles with official launch of the Work for Life brand capping the event. On hand were men of Operation Clean and Healthy Anambra Ocha Brigade, Anambra State Traffic Management Agency ATMA and the Federal Road Safety Corps FRSC to ensure that there was no traffic glitches in the course of the exercise. The Principal Secretary to Governor Willie Obiano, Sir Willie Mokoye, in his remarks, lauded the work noting that its routine practice depicts in larger sense Governor Obiano's keen belief in healthy lifestyle. Even now, everywhere. Last Saturday, we were in Colon. Tata, I dropped my way to full stop. Even men, I'm going to go. In an interview, the chairman, Anambra State Sports Development Commission, Chief Tony Oli, the organizer of the work, said the commission is looking forward in near future to partnering interested organizations to promote the brand along with plans to make the exercise a household practice across Anambra State. We've covered another 10 kilometers. So, so far we have done 50 kilometers. Remember our target is 120 kilometers, you know, in a year. So we have done 50 kilometers now and by the grace of God, you know, by April, we hope to take it to, uh, to Newi, so that Newi will also feel what it is, you know, to work for life. Also part of the work was the member representing Injikoka 2 constituency at the Anambra State House of Assembly, Honorable Pete Ibida, and his Injikoka 1 counterpart, Dr. Tim Ifedi Oramma, both describing the outing as practical show of their physical and mental alertness in view of next Saturday's State Assembly election. Also speaking, the Managing Director and Chief Executive Officer of the Anambra Broadcasting Service, ABS, Chief Uche Mwara, said the exercise has yielded commendable results, not just in physical fitness, but also in bringing diverse minds together under one spot. There were also aerobics accompanied by engaging sounds to give the long walk an alluring end. From the Njikoka Council Headquarters, Abagana, Daniel Ezigwe, ABS News.